I'm Pat from Supercars AU and today I am here outside the St. Regis Hotel where Brabus are having a display of some of their cars and let me show you them, they are very cool and I think you'll like them. So to start off, we have the, the Brabus B63S. So this is Brabus' version of the SLS AMG. Let me just walk around the car for a bit and I'll get into it more. So the B63, also known as the Biturbo 700, has a 6.3 liter naturally aspirated V8 that produces 700 horsepower, which is the same as a Lamborghini Aventador. So that's insane for this car. It goes from zero to 100 in 3.7 seconds and costs around $552,000. Singaporean dollars, which is the same as Australian. So, the car is absolutely insane. I'm not 100% on the carbon fiber on the rear fenders, but it is a very, very cool car the rest of the way. The exhaust pipes are like in a bronze with the Brabus logo on it. And the Brabus wheels, which are pretty cool. It is a very awesome car. I love the, the SLS. It is one of my favorite Mercedes cars, other than the 300 SL. But it is absolutely stunning. Especially with the going doors, which are currently closed. But I think it is an absolutely amazing car. Now, the next car I want to show you is very rare for Mercedes, or for Brabus as well. There are only three of them in the world, about 20 to 30 of them in Brabus form. I think you know what I'm talking about. It's this. The Brabus G700. Mercedes six-wheel dinosaur. And it is absolutely insane. It's a monster. So, cool thing about it is that so it's based off the G63 AMG 6x6, if you didn't know that already. Um, it has a 5.5 litre twin turbo V8. It produces 700 brake horsepower, the same as the B63S. It goes from 0 to 100 in 7.4 seconds, which isn't exactly what you call speed, but it's fast for a car, for a truck of this size. It weighs 3,800 kilograms. That is insane for this car. And it costs $773,000. So it is insane. It's absolutely insane. And that's unrelated, but that's a Nismo 370Z. Anyway. Back to the real car, the real monster here. So this, I, I, there was no words for it. It's just insane, especially with the red Brabus logo on the front, the carbon on top. It's, it's, it's crazy. It's absolutely crazy. So most of you would know that the G63 6x6 itself was originally for the Australian Army which is pretty cool and they made the normal luxury version of it and it was famously debuted on Top Gear with Richard Hammond driving it which is pretty cool how he drove it through the desert and through a water park I think and it, it, it's insane it's it's insane especially with these giant wheels six of them it's six wheels I, like I still can't grasp that in the back here, I think it's the wooden. Yeah, it's a wooden tray. These giant carbon fiber arches. And the, sp the springs in there are, are giant. This, I I'm just at a loss for words here. The spare up in there. 
And the cool thing about it is that the wheels can be deflated from switches inside, like on the overhead switches, which is hard to see since the windows are really tinted, but... <laughs> Sorry, but there's nothing, there's no words for it. It's just insane. It's crazy. It's absolutely crazy. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Please leave a comment below of what you think of these two cars, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Straight up, honey, really, I'm asking. Most of these niggas think they be macking, but they be 